Hello everyone, this is Fai. Today I'm back with this glowy Christmas makeup look for this year's holiday season. I will share with you the easiest way to create it in this video. Now let's begin with the tutorial. First of all, I'm going to apply some essence toner all over my face to keep it moisturized. And then I'm going to apply a slightly pink tone foundation all over my face to tone up the skin. I'm going to use this spongy makeup puff which is currently very popular as blending tool among Chinese makeup enthusiasts. This puff does magic on the skin. As you can see, it literally helps to blend the foundation smoothly and it helps to cover the pores quickly as well since it doesn't absorb the foundation as much as other sponges. You can skip this step if you don't have the circles. I'm going to cover my dark circles by using a cream concealer. And next, I'm going to apply a glow finish powder all over my skin. And now my face looks much brighter, right? Now I'm going to draw the eyebrows. I'm going to use one of my favorite eyebrow pencils which has three parts in one product. I'm going to use the pencil to shape the eyebrow first and using the brush to smudge the corner and create a gradation. And then I'm going to use the powder to soften any harsh line. It's time for the face contour. I'm going to contour my nose first by using the shading powder. Start from the side of my nose and blend it down to the nostril. Since I have chubby face, I'm going to focus more on the side of my face. It helps so much to apply more shading powder around the cheekbones to create a slimmer effect. I'm going to apply some onto my jawline and forehead as well. Moving on to the hair makeup, I'm going to apply the base color first all over my eyelids and then using smaller brush to apply some onto the lower lid. Next, I'm going to apply an orangey dusty pink color onto my upper lid and a little bit onto the lower lid as well. Since I don't have a bright red eyeshadow, I'm going to use this red blusher as an eyeshadow. I'm going to apply it onto the outer feet and blend it evenly. And then I'm going to apply it a little bit onto the inner corner as well like this. Next, I'm going to take a dark purple marine color and apply it on top of the red eyeshadow to deepen the color even more. Next, I'm going to apply a little bit of light yellowish bronze color onto the area between inner corner and the eyebrow, like this. Next, I'm going to apply a brown eyeshadow onto the mobile lid and onto the other corner a little bit. skip the glitter part let's apply some gold glitter onto the middle part of the upper lid use a clean brush to make the glitter look more subtle to give accent to the eye makeup I'm going to apply a glittery light eyeshadow onto the area near the tear duct like this now, I'm going to rim my eyes by using a dark tree brown pen liner. This pen liner is really cheap, probably around $2 or $3, but it's really good even when the weather is hot. I'm going to draw a long wing for this eye makeup. And then I'm going to use the same product to line my waterline as well. This is also the important part of this eye makeup. Draw a short line on the other corner like this to make the eyes look bigger and longer. Now, I'm going to 
to finish off their makeup by applying false lashes and mascara. Next, I'm going to use this bling glitter eye pencils, which are my favorite at the moment. I'm using the correct color to give more sparkle onto this area first. And then, I'm using the light pink color onto the lower lid to create the egg yosol effect. Next, I'm going to make this eye makeup look prettier by drawing a white line beneath the wing like this. It's important to make it feel like Christmas as well. <laughs> I want to create a blousing effect for this makeup, so I'm going to apply a pinky smoke blouser onto the apple on my cheeks. Line it inwards towards the nose a little bit like this and apply a little bit onto the chin as well to make the makeup look more fun i'm going to apply a little bit of red gloss onto the tip of my nose it looks cute right next i'm going to apply a little bit of highlighter onto some certain features of my face to make my face look more dimensional. And last for the lips, I'm going to create a soft gradation lips. First, I'm going to make my lips look bigger by covering my lip line with a nude lipstick. And then apply 3C Cheeky Rose which I don't know how to call this color all over my lips. Apply 3C top which is a dark red color onto the inner part of the lips and blend it out evenly. To make the lips look prettier, I'm going to apply a little bit of highlighter onto the cupid bow. And now the makeup is done. A dream of December nights, kissing under bright lights, snowflakes in my head. That's it for this Christmas makeup tutorial. I hope this tutorial can be an inspiration for you and if you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments below. I wish you a Merry Christmas and Happy Holiday. Thank you for watching and see you in my next video. Bye!